what's up you guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi hello I'm Lydia and if you are new here make sure you hit the subscribe button to join the growing family today I wanted to take a moment to talk about my arthritis now I know I've never made a video where I directly address my arthritis but I have in fact been diagnosed with arthritis since I was 17 it started in my hands it's gradually progressed to most of my joints I use a cane when I'm out it's been a very hard part of my life that I've had to accept and when I first got diagnosed I was told it was fast fastly progressive because between two scans that were just a few weeks apart my joints in my hands got so bad but arthritis has been something that I've dealt with for a long time now I was 17 when I was diagnosed I'm 26 now so it's been quite a long time and how I deal with it when I know it's fast progressive I know that I'll never have the mobility back that I've lost so I can't do things I enjoy like ice skating I can't I can't skate anymore because my ankles are too weak I can hardly walk up and down stairs let alone ice skate which I miss dearly I follow loads of figure skaters on TikTok and I watch the videos and I, I just miss it so much because it was something I used to do for fun like I'd go on my own and I'd just skate around the rink and it was just it's just something that I've lost the ability to do with arthritis. Now, I don't know why it's so aggressive. I wish I did. But I have it in, like, that's what I, my hand looks like. So, you can see why it stops me doing a lot of things. Literally every time I move, I click. I have arthritis in my hands, my wrists, my elbows, my shoulders. I have it in my hips, my knees, my feet, my toes. So I have it in a lot of places and it sucks, truthfully. I, I'll never be able to say that it's made my life brilliant because it hasn't. It's made my life a lot more painful to live. And I'm not on any pain meds at the minute for my arthritis. My, I was on amitriptyline. It interacted really badly with some of my psychiatric medication so I came off the amitriptyline. And I can't take paracetamol because I'm allergic to it. Which doesn't do much, but it's the only thing I can do. I was on codeine for a bit, and that helped, but I didn't want to stay on it long term because it's addictive. I think the day that I got told, Lily, you got progressive arthritis, is one of the days I'll never forget. It was just after I finished college, I went to a GP appointment, and so I got told. So, Right now I use a cane to get around. Two reasons. One, my knee is fucked. Don't know what I did to it, but it's fucked. But my ankles lock into place. So I use a cane to alleviate some of the pain. I wouldn't wish it on my worst enemy. I really wouldn't. Living when you're in pain is hard. Living when you know that pain's gonna get worse is horrific. One thing I want people to remember is I'm 26. This has been my life since I was 17, so I can just function with it like it's normal, because that is my normal. Now, I know I don't talk about it much, and the reason for that is I don't have much to actually say on the subject, because I can't change it. There's nothing I can do. So, I just have to roll with the... roll with it. Personally, I think I wish it had come on later in life, because it, it's just... It's been so inconvenient. Like when I have to change lying on the tube to go to uni, I have to hold the handrail going down the stairs with a cane in one hand, holding onto the rail with the other hand. And people get so pissed off with me because it's rush hour. Thanks uni for being a great factor in that. For starting my lectures at 9am when it takes me an hour to get there. Well done. I wish there was a positive ending to this, but th there is no treatment. I will have it for the rest of my life. So it's a hard one, really. But yeah, if you have any questions you want me to answer about arthritis or want me to talk more about arthritis and how I cope, let me know in the comments down below. Leave a thumbs up on the video if you have enjoyed this little talk. And don't forget to subscribe if you're new. I think I've already said that. 
editing me will find out. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.